even get to Ross. Break looks fun for 40 minutes and then to be never touched again. Yep, that sounds about right. <laughs> I opened a Why does it have to buffer so much? I opened a door. Now I'm squeezing through a gap. Cause I am Superman. There is some blood on the wall and on the freaking floor. What shall I do? I'm going to keep walking. Cause I'm Poopy McGee. I changed the reporter's name to Poopy McGee in my mind. So he's going to be known as Poopy McGee. Yep. What's wrong with Miles Upshur? Cause that's just too long. And Poopy McGee's like the main man in Oregon. You should have seen the Oregon Trail video I'm going to be up or the Oregon Trail videos I'm going to be uploading. and they are great. I uploaded one and I did an awesome 360 trick shot in that game. It's pretty amazing. <laughs> Look, it's a little file! Let Mouse to pick okay, up the document. The, part where you try to look at the, the, book. the game is the same price as CSGO. Freaking key. Whoa, that's amazing. I'm going to take a drink of some Dr. Wow. All right, I'm going to read this document now to clear my throat, you know. <clears throat> Markov. Project Wallrider. <laughs> Mount Massive Co. Case number 174. Patient intent. Oh, freaking whatever. Billy. Constellation dated 2012, October 14th. I mean, yeah. Intel data patient consult 2009-04-12 patient age 19 gender male observing physician Dr. Carl Houston therapy status patient claims to have progressed to self-directed elusive dream states however you say that word engine act activity observed at unprecedented scale Continuing stage 4 hormone schedule. Diagnosis. <laughs> Spirometry revealed no bronicle accumulation. You know what? You know what? Crap, I'm not going to read that. That's just that's just too hard. It makes me look like a moron. Alright, let's keep going. <laughs> like you don't already. <laughs> There's a hole in the wall and some blood. Oh, and some bloody footsteps. <laughs> hey. In the break room? No, they closed the door on me. I want into the bathroom. I need the bathroom. Okay? I need to use it. And someone just closed it on me. You know how rude that is? Do you have any idea how rude that was? I'm, I'm going to go in this vent that has blood all over it. Because that's smart, isn't it? Heck yeah. Oh, look. A cobweb. That's cool. Oh, you're already in the vent? Yep. I'm having did a good time. What, uh, did you happen to see what was on the counter in that break room before you went into the vent? No. You should have seen what somebody was going to have for a snack. You know what? I don't like how the guy came out of the restroom just come into the break room and just laugh at me, okay? That's messed up. Alright, I'm going to keep going. You Do you want to know what was supposed to be a snack with their cola? What? Was it? I think, if I recall correctly, it was supposed to be a piece of intestine. So, have you finished this game? Talking to me? Yes. I watched Markiplier play it. Okay. Have you played this game? No, I bought it on the Steam Summer so. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, that got me. That got me good. It, it just startled me, though. It just startled me. Little piggy got you? No. No, I opened the door and a jump scare just attacked me. Oh, it was a right. My gosh, the music's like ramped up and I couldn't hear you for crap, man. <laughs> yeah, you just jumped into the vent on my screen. Oh, that's a sexy body you got hanging up on the little ceiling. I love it. You look, you look so fine right now. I'm going to leave you there. Look, some... Now, who would do such a thing? They freaking... I mean, I know they killed the whole SWAT team. Whatever. That don't matter. What matters is they they, they just killed this book. 
this, they killed his bookcase, and I don't like that. <laughs> You don't care about the, all the heads that are probably around. No, that don't matter. The books is the main thing, because you know what's better than dead bodies? Knowledge. I read a book a day, and let me tell you, skinnier and beyond is the book to read. Right, hold okay. On. Hold on. The sacrifice. I'm scared. Oh, the science of faith. Uh, what else they got? Oh my, word. <laughs> oh my gosh, what are you gonna do? Come alive on the little stick? Oh, I knew it. I just knew it. He lowers my self esteem. They killed us. They got out. The variants. Yes, I know. No one cares, okay? I'm gonna die probably, so it don't matter. Okay, I'm just gonna say something, right? Okay. Why wouldn't the guy who was recording this, if he wanted the story, he's done got his story in the first nine minutes of recording. I mean, he's done got a whole dead SWAT team with a lot of heads in this place. And he's like, oh, I need to go deeper for more story. I just can't go back out. I mean, I need more story. Like... I mean, that's just retarded. Anyway, what will you do for Freddy Fish? The game Freddy Fish? I'm not sure. What's Freddy Fish? You don't know what Freddy Fish is? Nope. It's a game for little preschoolers. <laughs> <clears throat> just curious, it's a... did you... Uh, where are you at the moment? Oh, I just saw a big dude walk into the door. I bet he's gonna come behind me once I get in the little bookcase. I mean, I'm no expert, but I'm just suspecting that. He's gonna say, You little poopy, I'm gonna like, crap you. Oh, yeah, grab me, touch me, whatever. Well, I died in the first five seconds. <laughs> I mean, that, that would kill you. I'm sorry, you'd be dead. <laughs> you'd be dead in the first five seconds. Kinda depends. I don't. He's, do you not see the massive of his size? He probably throw you like 100 miles per hour through that glass. Your back would be all shattered up and crap. You'd be like on the ground going, "I'm paralyzed. I'm dead." Maybe. <laughs> oh yeah, I also fi found a Napoleon Dynamite figurine at a at a thrift store. So I bought it. It says vote nice. for Pedro. It says vote for Pedro on it. It's great. And I also found a llama. And you know how he feeds the llama? So I bought it too. Even though it's not officially the llama off the movie or anything, but, you know, I just figured it'd be nice to have. Oh, that guy got decapitated. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. I need to take a picture of that. Oh, you got decapitated too. You know, I really like this place, Stano. It's a very nice place. If you want a I mean, good pop top uh popper popper, just talk to the big guy that just threw you. Mr. Big and Burley. I mean I just don't know why you're down on it so bad, Dino. I mean it's a beautiful place. You just gotta look past the 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 broken bookcase, okay? The broken bookcase is what brought the value down on this this hospital, okay? <laughs> yeah, okay, we'll go with that. <laughs> Tina, eat the food Gosh! Um. I swear to God, if I actually manage to get my own channel going, it will have to take a lot of persuasion from the people, as soon as I also get the money, to get this mm, game. Mm. It's going I to can, take a I, lot of persuasion. I can T-Pag this guy's intestines. That's amazing. I'm going to do it. Oh, yeah. Don't you? Oh, <laughs> I'm also gonna call all in the blood. Oh, I'll put my hand in your intestines. <laughs> this game is so fun. Oh yeah. <laughs> Let me just put your my hand in your in your intestines. <laughs> oh, in that blood too. Hmm. Oh, I can put my hand in the glass too. Let's make my 
my hand blood. My hand blood, my hand bleed, yeah. Oh my gosh, guard, dude. I own the freaking movie. Yes, I do too. I just know how to pause and play the movie, or uh, the stream, and it just caught me up to where you are now. Oh, what nice bloody pants you have. Also, cop, you suck at your job, okay? I'm just going to say, you let someone come in here and just own the place, and you don't even have your... You don't even, you, you probably just ate the, you probably just stuck a gun down your throat, okay? That's probably how bad of a cop you were. Anyway, I'm gonna pick up this document and read it now. Dear Diary, The Murkoff Corporation, United States Office Warrant for Seizure Case Number 29475810, in the master matter of the seizure of Mount Massive Psychiatry Center, Murkoff Physical, f f f whatever, Mount Massive Wilderness Area, County Road, or Country Road 112, having been <laughs> made before the Board of dire Directors by Murkoff Hordeline Security, who has the reason to believe catastrophe security failure of whatever center will imitate danger and environment contamination. Amazing. We were satisfied that the avid, uh, avid, uh, avid, uh, avid, and testimony established su 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 sufficient evidence to acquire area. urgent a a of action on the past of image S and grounds for the assurance of this warrant. You are hereby required to grant. MHS full access to officer facilities and surrender complete authority to its agents. By acceptance of this document, you and any surveying relatives surrender all claims of litig litigation against litigation. it lit of litigation, yes, against the Murkoff Corp or its sub Subsidiaries, yes, for the actions of the MHS of the circumstances which require their actions, regardless of. Yes, I got that. <laughs> I'm gonna open the store now. Oh, it's bought by a freaking computer desk. What a loser. What kind of person would do such a thing? Would we'll block a freaking door from the computer desk. Oh, there's a nice man in the wheelchair. I'm gonna go say hello to him. Never mind. Sorry, sir. The door is locked. I can't say hello to you. Now I'm gonna go over here. I was walking down the street when I saw this portrait of this thing, dude. I said, hello, dude. What you doing? And I said, yeah. And then I looked at his picture and it said, Cleese Perry, director of the historical refinement. 1959 through 1961. Oh yeah, that was my number. <laughs> Yay, yeah, a gender bucket. Witness. I will witness this. I witnessed the. Ooh, that's some nasty toilet paper. I mean, ooh, it's like. I mean, I. This isn't nasty. I mean, sure, this guy's dead on the pot. What did really happen? No one really killed him. What happened was he sh he ate some uh, Texas Roadhouse and he and he had a horrible diarrhea crap and I mean it just bled out on him okay like I mean he just exploded some blood out I mean I'm sorry but there's nothing w they could do they were just trying to help him and in the process they they got blood all over their hands and they just tried to wipe it off the wall and it act uh, like he just uh, conveniently spelled witness I mean there's that, that's the obvious explanation. And this yellow toilet paper was the reason of his death. Did you have to also... notice the guy at the end of the hall? Oh yeah, I saw him a bit. A little. Yeah, I saw him a little bit. Also, there's a red, another red blood toilet. But that's because there was another man that ate Texas Roadhouse with that other guy. <laughs> My explanations are so clear, Dono. I don't know what... Yeah, I mean... See, I can just give explanations for this game.